So flying a drone is awesome, but eventually at some point you're going to crash the drone. And traditionally when you crash the drone on dry land, replace a couple of propellers, put the battery back in, and usually you're good to go. But I happen to live next to the Atlantic. And that can cause an entirely different set of issues if you happen to crash your drone into the water. But have no fear, because in less than five minutes, I'm going to show you how you can possibly repair your drone if you dunk it deep into the water or a swamp, like I did, for instance. So, I'm out here trying to make a Trek video for my new Trek rail. You know what I mean? Because there was no videos available when I bought it. So, I brought my... Uh, my DJI Mini 3 and I thought a really good shot would be coming over the water up to the bike which I did and then of course I just had to push it one more time which ended up the bike landing I mean the drone landing right there so I had to climb through all that <laughs> all the way around to get the drone a little worse a little worse for wear. Very, very wet. But no leeches, and that's a good thing. I'll let you know if the Mini 3 still works after this. I told you I'd let you know if she worked after this. This is her after being completely dunked into a swamp. It took me about 24 hours, a little bit of stressing because I had just got the drone, but I was able to bring it back to life and I used the same old trick that everybody's been using for cell phones and tablets over the years. I broke out a big bag of rice. Many people many times have tried to use compressed air to blow the water out of the drone or other electronic things. All that does is cause more damage. It actually supercharges the water into places it wouldn't have found on its own. So don't use this. Simply use this. Grab a large Ziploc freezer bag, fill the bottom quarter of it with some white rice, and then simply take the battery and the SD card out of the drone and place the drone into the bag. You don't want to submerge the drone into white rice. Set it up just the way I'm showing right here. That way you don't get rice stuck in every nook and cranny of the drone. That's what you don't want. And then simply stand the battery on end. Give it about 24 to 48 hours and chances are the drone will come back to life and work perfectly. It's as easy as that. And the entire thing is under five minutes, except for the 24 to 48 hours. But that's neither here nor there. If you found any value in this video, please hit that like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment below, and I will try to return the favor. I am out.